So I forgot to turn the camera on, um, but basically all I did was cover a 6x6 six six, uh, piece of watercolor paper with black gesso, and this is some that I got on sale, I believe at Hobby Lobby. The tag still isn't on it, but I believe it was at it was either at Hobby Lobby or it might have been at Dick Blick's. And this is Bob Ross Black Gesso. <clears throat> and today I'm going to do the Doodles Mixed Media Morsel. And the reason why I chose black was because I want to use, I just found these Sharpie oil-based um, paint pens. And I want to try this out. So it says... Remove cab with marker in tip up position. Oh, tip up. Depress to release paint. Recap and shake well. So I need something dark to try this out on because I certainly don't want to just start. not have any idea whether or not there's paint coming out. And there's paint coming out. So, um, as the doodles say, there's not really a plan per se of what you want to do, so I'm just going to kind of doodle. I'm not really a doodler, not going to lie. Doodling is not really my thing. I do like to zentangle, but even that is not really like doodling for me because I don't doodle. But um, let me see. Maybe I can turn this into some journal as well, some Bible journal. Kill two birds with one stone. What do y'all think? Okay. So let me get my Bible out here. Let's see. Let's see, that's a page that I did. Maybe Psalms. I love Psalms. Let's see. I think Psalm. I think that one. Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. I think that's very appropriate right now. because of everything that's been going on with the shootings and ISIS and everything else. So, blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. And you know what? I have an idea. Okay, so I just got my journaling genie out. And I used this before in the Wavy Letters mixed media morsel. I love this. And I'm just going to grab a white pencil so I can see on this black background. And let's see. Blessed is the nation. So blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. So that actually works out really well. And it'll give me some doodling room. So let's see. This is a this is a watercolor one. So Let me try pencil. I don't think I can see pencil. Well, yeah, a little bit. All right. So I'm just going to outline kind of where I want my letters to go. Well, I can sort of see, which is just as well.
So this is a really wide little journaling template. These little templates that I'm drawing out here. And I'm good with that because that gives me the opportunity to have a little space so everything doesn't run together. So while on the first one I only did the bottom line, on the last one I'm only doing the top line. I don't know. You guys can see that. So I will put letters in here and in here and in here, but I won't have to worry about any separation. So there'll be some separation there. And that's important for me. So let's see. Let's just put our letters out there. So, I really like that. It actually worked out really well. <clears throat> and I'm going to leave my lines and stuff there. I'm going to wait until the very end to erase everything because I can use those to doodle with. So, that's pretty exciting. I like that. And I'm not having to press down very hard. I mean, it's a bonus is that the paint is really just free flowing right out of this pen. So that's good. I have had some where you had to really press down to get the paint. Get the paint to do what you wanted it to do. But not so much with this one, so that's good. Wish I had bought some other colors. Some nice bright colors. So I'm gonna let that dry for just a couple of seconds. Maybe I'll use my let me use my thing. Close this up.
Okay, so I just realized that I had forgotten to turn the camera back on. <clears throat> All I'm doing is just adding some little dots randomly, sort of randomly. They're on the lines so that you can, or so that I can, delineate where the curve of the words is so it doesn't look awkward. And I kind of feel like it looks a little bit like marquee lights doing this. Just me. So I'm really enjoying it. Okay, so I really love this, and I'm just going to leave it like it is. Um, I'm going to let it dry, and then I'm going to erase my pencil lines gently with a gum eraser, which I have right here, and I have ripped off a piece of it, apparently. I think in my last one, I ripped off, in my wavy letters one, I ripped off a piece of it. So I'm just going to use this piece and I'll erase my pencil lines and it is ready to go. So, blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. Psalm 33, 12. I hope you all reflect on that today. Those of you who are, um, especially who are concerned about the things that are going on in the United States currently with the uh, tension and um, just pray for our country. So, have a wonderful day, and I hope you enjoyed my mixed media morsel slash Bible journal um, doodle. Have a great day.